Let's clear the path together for the children to speak and walk the earth in peace. Hi, I'm Christopher, and I'm part of Children Healing the Earth. Children Healing the Earth is a grassroots campaign to help heal the earth. We have an annual journey to go to different places. This year, it's here in Maui. Next year, it's in Washington, D.C. We hope to gather as much momentum as possible. It is time for the children to be heard. We're here at our Youth Summit on Maui, 2015, Children Healing the Earth. Gathering at this stage to bring this film together for the rest of the world to hear. To hear them loud and clear what has been said over and over again through time. But it is time now to really listen and for us, the rest of us, to do. They have the wisdom. They need the support. Please hear them. All right, um, my name is Grace Wiley. I'm 14 years old, and my ancestors are from Scotland, Ireland, and Germany. Hi, my name is Christopher, and I'm 11. My ancestors are in Mexico, Peru, Switzerland, Scotland, and Ireland. My name is Carver Glom, and I am 14 years old, and my ancestors come from Europe, most specifically Germany, Ireland, uh, Scot Scotland, and the Czech nation. My name is Kaya, I'm 16, and my ancestors are from Germany, Czechoslovakia, and the Netherlands. Hi, my name is Randy Lanzaga, I am 13 years old, and my ancestors are from Honolulu, Hawaii, Germany, India, and Russia. Okay, so hello. My name is Haley Knight. I am 13. My ancestors are from Italy, Germany, Australia, Scotland, and Canada. I'd love to see a lot less pollution in this world especially in the oceans, there's all these little islands along the coast that are completely filled with trash um, that we really don't need to make. Um, and there's lots of birds and animals that live there that are native there, and they're full of trash because they think it's food, but it's not, and it's poisoning them and killing them. My biggest concern for the earth would be littering because it not only affects earth, it affects us and our health, because if a piece of trash of like does something to a tree that that affects our oxygen my biggest concern about people is littering um, I think people should throw away their trash instead of just leaving it around the most important issue for us and this earth is how we're polluting it and how bad we're taking care of it many people don't care about how the earth is doing or what effect it's having on anyone else they just care about money. Well, we're here to change that. We want to make it so it's not all about money. We want to make it so it's about having a happy Earth. My biggest concern is pollution in the ocean because not only does it affect the animal life and coral life as well, but also affects how we enjoy the ocean and when we swim in it, there's like pollution all around. How I feel about non-organic food is we should be thankful for what we have, not having someone make it better for us. We should be thankful for what we already have, not how someone can make it bigger, someone can make it better. I think there should be more organic foods in the stores and that they should let you know if the food is organic or not organic. I believe that non-organic food should be banned forever. I would like to see changed is no more GMO and what we've been doing to the animals and plants is really, really sad. I think that GMOs and non-organic farming methods are, I don't really like, because their original intent was to help people, but it was also to gain money. 
Now, they went overboard because now America relies on it. And 32 countries have banned GMOs. There are many chemicals in it that you don't want. Pesticides, pharmacides, and many others. Some of which you use in household cleaning. That creeps you out, doesn't it? It creeps me out. So please, don't support them. Support your local organic farmers. Thank you. I think that GMOs are not good. Um, I think that it's not fair the way that they treat the plants and animals, especially the animals. Um, I watched a documentary about it and they say that the cows don't feel any pain when they like force feed them and the cows are all infected because they're constantly having milk sucked out of them and they're all pussy and yeah it's not good stuff so I think the mistreating of the animals is not good. What do you think about how humans are using nuclear power? I think that it's a good idea but they, it's not helping as for instance nuclear bombs truly devastating and nuclear power it's extremely dangerous a lot of it is the food we have enough food for every single person to have a good amount of food every day and live but the way that we distribute it is not good like in America we overeat and then in India there's rice, like huge piles of rice that have guards, but nobody's eating it and it's just rotting. And nobody in India or Africa is getting the food that they can eat there. I would like to say that we need more peace. The world has been in a state of war for the past hundred years and it's really not helping anybody. There are lives that have been lost. The earth has been damaged. And we've gone through so much just to make sure we win. It's too much. We need to stop that now. What I would like to see change is how we power things rather than using fossil fuels. I believe that people today are more concerned about themselves rather than the earth and people surrounding them and are more selfish and don't really care about anything else but themselves. We're using these materials that we don't necessarily need and yet we're using all this supply from the earth that is just pretty wasteful and sad. My biggest concern about the earth is the extinctions of animals. To help prevent the extinctions of animals, I would like to put a ban on hunting for fun. My biggest concern for people would be that everybody is being one man for themselves, not everybody coming together as a whole because if everybody's one man for themselves, we're starting to fall apart when really we should be coming together. I would like to see the world change for the better. I would like to see no pollution, every animal species at its correct rate, every thing living in perfect harmony. My biggest concern about people is that we've been in a state of war for the past hundred years. And not only that, but history is written by the victors. And the loser's story is lost forever. It's us that changed the world.
Fresh coconuts. Get your fresh coconuts. God's Gatorade. Support your local grower and your local farmer. Don't leave Maui without tasting Maui. Come on, somebody. Who's thirsty? Grown here, not flown here. Don't panic, it's organic.